Oh, come on. Okay. I just arrived home. But before that, I had to buy something at the nearest Mercury drugstore in my area. And uh, let me just show you, I got this. All right, this one. Uh, this is the antigen test kit. Okay, I'm not, I'm not feeling well. I've been under the weather. For a couple of days last saturday i've had the most severe and painful i don't know fever or flu in 2024 so today is is it yeah november november 6th okay at past almost three in the morning and here we go we have this antigen test which i got from bgc mercury you know fronting st luke's for 333 and 75 all right there you go the mercury drugstore in the 32nd street corner fourth street and i'm sweating i'm sweating all right because i had to walk to get to that place and all right before we open this they call it i don't know if this is the antigen is like a brand name or i don't know but what i see here is that one step test for sars dash cove dash two antigen yeah it's antigen colloidal gold so this is 330 plus pesos so Right, we're gonna open it and we're gonna test this because you know while at that mercury drug i noticed that most customers at past two in the morning were buying medicines for flu and i don't know covid this is the flu season okay that we've all been talking about prior to COVID because you know what happened during the pandemic is that the flu went away suddenly and everyone had COVID like nobody had flu anymore so what happened to the to the flu people during the pandemic so most of them were probably diagnosed as COVID the flu you know symptoms so all right here we go we have everything here um i i don't know if i yeah i think i i i did try antigen test once in the past and it turned out negative and that was after i was diagnosed or yeah i was tested for covid using rt pcr test which i which i paid for like three thousand five hundred pesos okay you know remove this stick from the packaging and i'm sweating insert the swab into the after uh, insert the swab after sampling to the extraction tube the one i'm holding right now this is liquid and make sure that you know oh, what the fuck it's on my laptop now gently squeeze okay and add two drops of the solution into the sample all right two drops okay and then what now? Oh, two drops. One eternity later. All right, this is really embarrassing because <laughs> what happened is that I did it wrong. I did not put the liquid or pour the water into the correct spot, which is this one, the well. This is supposed to be the well where I should have poured the liquid into so instead i put it here i'm so stupid and you know it took like more than more or less one hour for me to see the line that shows there is a one red line okay according to the instruction uh para do maging positive both the c and the t should have red lines okay red lines which we don't have red lines but the problem here is 
okay according to according to the instruction as well read the result visually in 10 to 15 minutes don't read the results after 20 minutes so what we have here is invalid although it's showing here that it i might be negative i had to buy another kit from 7-eleven within my area and this one costs uh 350 pesos all right 350 pesos the one from mercury costs like 330 plus so sars cove are they no they're not the same in terms of their packaging okay um this one uh i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna do it right okay this is really embarrassing i'm sorry so sars cove 2 antigen rapid test kit is what it shows here so all right i'm not gonna read to you the detail but let me just open the box we have almost exactly the same you know stick i feel so stupid for i don't know so what we're get all right it it has different uh, formulation or i don't know um kits but anyways i think we're good and we have this okay test cassette is what they call it in the name of testing you know whether i am positive or not we're gonna check again and i spent 700 nearly 700 pesos already so this is the first time that you see someone wearing mask doing this swab test yeah and ito yung solution making sure that i'm not gonna do something stupid again this time because I don't want to spend another 300 plus pesos. So squeeze. Okay, so gonna uh, almost exactly the same thing we did kanina. We're good. And then, ilagay na nga dito. One, oh my. Super parang dami. Okay. So we were able to put it there into the correct spot. Unlike earlier that I was so stupid na hindi ko nalagay doon. And then, oh my god. So, you... Uh, Unti-unting na nagkakaroon ng red. Okay? Unti-unting nagkakaroon ng red. Andali lang. Read the result 15 to 20 minutes after adding the sample. Okay, I'm gonna be back after 10 minutes. A few minutes later. Alright, the final reveal. Okay, so it's more or less 10 minutes already. Yeah, I'm sure it's more or less 10 minutes since I finish the testing so i put the kit inside this box so to surprise myself kung positive pa ako hindi so kasabi sa control sa kasa test panels or um, areas dapat may solid red line if it's a faint pinkish line sa c you know c part then it's negative so Alright, without too much ado, we're gonna show the result. I'm not looking at it yet, but... Okay. It's... Just one line, which is negative. I don't know, but... But there's this, you know, very... Faint hue on the T. On the T line. Yan yung, yan yung solid red, tapos yun yung faint. Positive yan. Tapos dito negative. So... Based on what we have here, I'm positive. Okay. Uh, the first one, kasi nga, hindi gumana kasi bobo ako. Wala kang makita. Super liit. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm COVID positive if we're gonna believe this. Okay? You know. For thumbnail purposes. I'm positive. Alright. So, this is not the first time that I've had COVID. Okay. In fact, I believe that I could be... One, I could be the one of the very first. This is probably my third time. Okay. The first time was even before the lockdown was declared. Because I had all, all the symptoms. Okay. That was Feb of 2020. Imagine that. So, lockdown was declared March 
14 if I'm mistaken somewhere along that line or that week and then the second time I, I had COVID was um, I was tested using RT-PCR on October 21st 2021 okay um, I had to pay the agency I don't know the, the company to um, do the swabbing or swab test sa apartment ko the time sa Makati rin. and I tested positive I paid like 3,500 for that and then this time I had all the symptoms you know last Saturday today's Wednesday last Saturday I was so sick that I you know I had fever I couldn't get up the whole you know the whole 24 hours I was on my bed the whole you know the entire day 24 hours and I and after that I was um, feverish I was coughing um, yung sumasakit yung yung chest ko pag umuubo pa ng dry cough or I don't know so this could be it and kanina-kanina lang sabi ko sa colleague ko medyo hindi ako nakakamoy pati yung alcohol hindi ko nakamoy yung ng, ng mabuti okay it's it's faint smell the, the, you know the alcohol I saw propel I don't know the, the, yung matapang na alcohol you're supposed to smell that but I you know, I it, it was faint. I couldn't smell it. Like, you know, I don't know. Pero yung panlasa ko, medyo kwan siya bland. That you would suspect that I probably just have flu. But then, nausin na naman, bumalik ang COVID siguro. But this time, the good thing is, I, I, I have all these, I have all these, what do you call, antibodies. Nagpa anti vaccine pa ako ano to nagpa vaccine pa ako okay so it would be easier for my body to handle it's gonna be very ordinary na yung covid but yeah if if I to believe this test then I'm covid positive kaya kayo ingat ingat uh, wear face mask I'm gonna be informing my colleagues now about this one and uh, uh, usang sipon, usang ubo. Uh, my voice, for example, is telling, right, that I'm not feeling well. I'm under, a bit under the weather. Okay, but this is probably the recovery area because, you know, since Tuesday, how many days now, right? So, since Saturday, I'm sorry, yeah, Saturday, when every, I felt so sick, you know, and the pain and everything. So, if you like this video, uh, by the way, magpa swap test kayo. Bili lang kayo, mura lang to, okay? Uh, just to test for yourself. At para sa maiwas, you know, hindi kayo makahawa ng iba. Diba? Lalo na pag may kasama, ko sa, kasama kayo sa apartment or sa bahay or you go to work, right? And uh, here we go. Uh, this is again the Daily Netizen and have a good one to all of you.